Hi, my name is Stephen McGee and I'm the author of Toxic Health and we're here to look into a very interesting effect that 32 inch cathode ray tubes generate and this is a 32 inch cathode ray tube TV and you'll see that the screen has foil on it and before I go any further I want to make it very clear that I do not advise people to repeat this experiment because on that foil is a very, very large AC voltage. So you would not want to come into contact with it. But we can actually make use of that AC voltage with a fluorescent tube. And uh, as you can see, this end is open. And this end is grounded to a ground rod that is in my garden. And we're going to make this tube light up simply by touching this open end to the foil on the TV and it will make the tube light up because of the high voltage that is present and also the current so there's, there's sufficient current on that foil to actually light this fluorescent tube it's a very interesting effect and one of the reasons why I'm researching why these fluorescent tubes light in fields is I'm trying to understand not only how they interact with televisions but also how they interact with power lines and uh, appears to be an electrostatic field that is required to make these tubes light. So I'm going to show you the electrostatic field effect and uh, you're going to be quite surprised and uh, as I say before I do this I do not recommend that you repeat this. You should not be doing this unless you are completely competent at doing this experiment. So not recommended let's see what happens. So let's switch off the light and let's put it towards the TV. As soon as it touches the TV it will light up. Very, very interesting. And you can hear the foil humming. So the foil on the TV starts vibrating like crazy when the tube is in contact with it. So there are absolutely no doubts that around this 32 inch cathode ray tube TV that we have very large electrostatic fields that are occurring near to the screen. And that foil is not actually taped on, it's actually just being held on by an electrostatic field. We can see that even if we don't touch the end of the tube to it, we just touch the glass tube to it, it lights up and we can hear it crackling. So there you have it. That's a very, very cool effect that televisions create with fluorescent tubes and foil and it currently has unknown consequences to human health. I hope you enjoyed this presentation and I wish you the very best of health. Thank you.